Greetings everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in a mod called Hearts of Minecraft Overworld in Flames Beta. Now, the mods we're using here are obviously the mod I just said, Stitch and Tool Mod, Player of the Peace Conferences, but I was watching a certain Rambler try out this mod, even though I had an eye on this mod before I even played it, and I wanted to try out this mod for ourselves, or at least myself, and we're going to play as a Piglin Horde all the way over here, which, if we look at the screen, that is some interesting pathfinding or uh, passageway for us to get to the Southern Player Empire. Hmm. But we shall begin with our focus playing as a Piglin Horde. Remember the play, as long ago the horrifying players came to our lands, we pushed them out, but we will not forget the pain they caused, which we get a lot of political power, and remember the scars of old, and we have a total of 14 divisions of Piglin battle groups, with a little under 1.9 million Piglins ready to fight and die. But we must remember the scars of old. Years ago, the players came to our lands to seek riches and fortune. After years of occupation, our noble pig pigmen managed to push them out of our lands, but with a huge cost. We have spent almost the entirety of the last decade building swords, armor, and b b bows to fight against the tyranny that was placed upon us years ago. We must have our revenge. We will have our revenge no matter what, and next we shall do our new army. When we defeat the players, we were still devastatingly weak. However, we have spent time building, our building up ourselves for victory. I will say, though, like... I'm interested to see what, what this mod has in store for us. Wow, I've not actually seen the entire thing here. Look at that. Uh, but a grand army. We've raised a glorious legion. Gas, piglins, and skeletons alike have joined us in the conquest of the players. However, our predecessors tell of thousands of players waiting for a return. We must mobilize millions of our kind to fend off the players forever. Rise, my piglins. Rise, rise, rise. And actually, there's only one template we have here. And it's 24 with combat, so I'm going to... I kind of want to lower that. Wow, we need a lot more infantry equipment. Holy cow. So let's cut that down a little bit more. And as much as I love planes, go to five. We're going to need a lot more of that stuff. And I would like some artillery on here. How much artillery do we have for our soldiers? Not a lot. But if we throw in some support artillery, that might be okay. And actually, we can do this to help lower our combat width. We'll, we'll make our soldiers a little bit uh, more effective, t potentially. So We're out of this, but not by much. Cool. Um, you know what? I've, always, I've been thinking about this in the back of my mind. You know, I normally don't say or talk about this channel too much, like off screen or you know in videos that could hurt me later or anything like that and it's not gonna hurt me or anything but i was thinking you know what if we can get this video to like 250 likes i will feature minecraft on this channel sometime not sure when and i might include my disc mod uh, mods from my discord server maybe or even just members i don't know but if we can get this video to 250 likes maybe we'll play some minecraft because i've actually been wanting to play some minecraft for a while but rebuilding the nation when the players came they destroyed everything over the years we've slowly built up our nation again my friends yes we must build it up. Oh, how the crafting tables have turned! Never in the history of Minecraft has a mob been able to stand up to the vile and devilish players. But now the tide has turned. After years of construction, one of the many projects we'd embarked on were ensuring our gold was smelted, correct, and smelted and ready. Building a brand new nether fortress. Abandon uh, player outpost. Which is right here. Okay. Or forging bastions all across our territory. Factories are pretty darn nice. I like the gold, but it, there does not seem to be any sort of benefit to that. So, while we would like more land forts here, I think maybe forging bastions all across our territory could be very beneficial, especially for more military factories. But getting to, to the lands of the players. When the players came, many of our troops noticed that they came through purple glass-like panels surrounded by obsidian. When they left, these panels closed. Is there a way to reopen them? Hmm... And we're also building some anti-air, some support equipment, and some light tanks. Oh, our plan, though. When the players came, many of our troops noticed that they came through purple glass-like panels surrounded by obsidian. When they left, these panels closed. It is our absolute top priority to find a way to reopen them. We must move quickly. And placing obsidian blocks. Using old diagrams and notes, our workers have figured out a way to rebuild the same structure the players used to get to us. Civilian factory, military factory, military factory. Oh, sign us up. We need more infantry equipment, more b swords and bows and all the good stuff like that. Stone, stone sword kits. Very cool. But now we must make a choice. We should we create a great key? Or we should find alternative methods. Now, when we do this one, we get political power and mobilize our industry, which we get 4 plus 4 plus 4. It's usually 12 military factories. Or we go to get more political power. And we mobilize our piglins for 200,000 more manpower. Now, 1.9 is already pretty darn good. We have nothing here. And no has no, no. We have nothing here. So political power seems to be... A little bit of a waste. Oh. Um. And you know what? We are fascists. You know what? Fascism in, fascism in Minecraft? Who could have thought of such a thing? Hes Festus. 
though apparently dead. <sighs> Glorious volunteer only. Mm. I love being on war economy at peacetime. But uh, actually, this one requires this one: load order of battle piglin reserves or regeneration of the population. Uh, Ten percent monthly population isn't really that great. So ultimately, political power means nothing. Factories are great, and monthly population doesn't really mean too much to us when 10% of 66 is only 6 more. Or we could get more political power, which means nothing. More manpower, which would be very good. Or we get more reserves. Let's go with creating the Great Keep. The players use some sort of contraception. Or contraption. Oh boy. To activate these panels, let us build it ourselves. No, not contraception here. No, 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 no. But mobilize the piglins. The key to victory is a large army. We need to recruit, rearm, and prepare to crush the players, my friends. And then, train powerful warriors. TP. I love TP. I wonder how much more piglins we're going to be able to get because of this. Oh, that's actually a 35-day focus. Look at that. Look how fast this mod moves. Holy cow. Oh, good day. Wow, it's just dropping like numbers. Holy smokes, but then study player tactics. And you know what? We also have a little bit of SP here. Oh, this is a 70-day focus. Wow. So I went from, uh, let's see, how, much, how many days was this? 7 to 35, so 5 times the amount of time. And then double that amount of time. And wow. 100,000 things of stone sword kits? Wow, that's a lot of bad words, but our revenge, phase one. Oh, and we have a uh, massive continent to conquer, so... Oh, the undead lands are doing stuff over here. Oh. And we have improved infantry equipment one. Now, let's grab some support weapons, too. Even though it's only year nine, it's okay. Uh, iron sword kits? He's, uh, he's got different... Yep, that's definitely something different than normal. I'm not sure what he's... Oh. Can you smoke in Minecraft? Yeah, I'll be honest, I don't play Minecraft very much. I Like I said earlier, I do want to play more Minecraft. Play a little bit more Minecraft, but I'm not very good at it, and it's been literally years since I've actually really went ahead and tried to play it, so. But hey, if if we can smoke in Minecraft, is that a bad thing? I don't know, maybe. Uh, train powerful warriors, but study the player tactics. SP, we love the SP. Uh, oh, create an army? I don't think we need that for right now. A divisions? What type of template are they? 20 combat with as well? Ah, uh, with our, our, with the artillery. Actually, I should have left these guys as 20, four, 24 combat with so we get more manpower and guns technically, but the end of an empire, M, end of empire dot D, the union of sense superior. And Minecraft, can you become a substance abuser? It's a good thing that this, uh, my channel is set to not for kids. I'll put it like that. Hmm. But armor and bows. Oh, 100,000. Holy crud. Arenos. That's a lot. That's a whole lot. So we gotta get more. Actually, we don't need to make any more of this. Uh, get more artillery. We need a little bit more steel, so. And we can't trade for it, so we have to steal it from other people. So be it. Ooh, actually, how much are we getting, actually? We can, uh, we can lower the amount we're extracting. So let's go down a little bit. Exports. There we go. Bows and armor, and then negotiate with Nether, Nether Endermen, which get more speed and division attack. Sign us up. Hopefully, our land auction will be doing okay, and we're going down superior firepower, which it, which had actually already started us off on. So, I love the soft attack. In a few days, we'll have more support weapons, or just was that iron armor? Maybe no, this is iron armor. I don't know. Also, as you do, as you can see there, we've got horses. Now we could make these guys. Uh, that's not a horse. Uh, and actually, that's a... Is that... It's either a very miniature truck or, or motorized unit, or that's just a giant guy. Either one of those two. I'm not sure which one, but still. All right, my fellow piglins, we must train... Tr How fast are we making divisions? Holy crud. Negotiate with a nether endermen. Ah, oh, iron sword gets very good. The portals are opened. In 70 days, we become the owner and core the nether portals. And we will declare war on the Union. I hope this goes well. I have not tried this off-screen at all. I don't know what's going to happen. Even though, from watching a certain Rambler, things go a bit hectic for the uh, player down there. Alright, that's not too bad. Uh, since we have so many, we can like share the steel a little bit better. I would like to make tanks, but obviously we'll see when we get there. And the portals are opened. Do we have actually any air bases? Do we actually have any... Pl no, we have no planes. Uh, we're going to need Look at that. Pathfinding. My goodness. Hopefully we get some planes, because we are making some fighters. That would be really good. Delay doctrine. Good. Just in time for more organization. And how about mobile defense? Bonuses to defense. Sign us up. Very, very good. Wow. We just have to be a little bit careful of how we wage our war, because, well, it's going to become very bloody very soon. Rockwell... Oh, we need some more steel. Oh, yes, please. 
And as you can see, I'm building up a whole, whole, whole ton of uh, factories. Civilian factories, to be precise. The bolts will be opened w probably within the next 45 seconds. So, not too bad. Probably more like 20 seconds, actually. And research. Oh, if we can get this done fast, more breakthrough would be so nice. And we're still training our soldiers, but... Uh, maybe stop training. My friends, the second nether war. The time is the fire in which we burn. Onwards, my friends. Onwards. Invading the overworld tutorial. We have now seized control of the portals bordering the southern player empire. We have some troops that have already established a bridgehead. You should try to link up the offense, offensive points to ensure maximum supply. Your top priority is to transport the troops from the nether to the overworld, but sending thousands of troops through the small portals will take time. Onwards and upwards. Wait, these are just brand new soldiers. Holy crud. Whoa. Um, promotion costs cheaper? Yes, thank you. Zoglin? I don't know about you, but I like Poglin. And we shall get Doglin. And we shall have Woglin. Is this all the... No, oh, we have another portal up there too. And Army 5, Toglin. In addition with someone who's already getting attacked under the command of Logan. Well, wow, they're actually, look at that, that's so cool. They're actually attacking with quite a few guys. Uh, let's see, you guys are down here. I don't think anyone expected the Piglin Empire to strike back. Now, I don't want to throw too many divisions in here, or supplies are going to get really bad. Hopefully, going through here would be really good for us, though. Very good. Oopsie. I would like to send soldiers down here, but we shall see. Oh, and are they in a faction? Yes, the Southern Protection Pact. Now, that's very wet. I like it wet. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at the textures. Oh, look at them. Oh, my goodness. It's actually wet. Wow. Wowzers. All right, I'm going to send the next 18 divisions over here. And I'll send these guys up here. Actually, how strong is a southern player union? Ah, a bunch of communists, I see. Countess Victoria. With the player nation treaty. Protected by the Great Fortress. Losers of the Nether War. War, I should say. The player trade agreement. As well as ambushed. Oh, wow. Attack and defense is super low for quite a long time. Holy crud. That's really bad. That's incredibly bad. Uh, but I guess we'll go... We can't do that one. It's about a year ahead of time. Um, armor, horse head armor? Sure, why not? Did our soldiers make it? Do we have a navy? No, there's no navies. Okay. Oh, did we lose a port? I think we lost a port. Did we lose a port? We might have. Ah, more divisions. Jolly good. Well, the overworld will be ours. Just far wiggle sound goes way down. Okay, that sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, look at our guys in the water. Oh, wow. Come on, guys. We gotta link up. We gotta keep moving out. Having a good... Oh, we lost a port. Not all ambushes or attacks can be successful. What a shame. That's why you don't want him to attack like crazy. Uh, sometimes it goes really, really poorly for us. Oh, and they died. Big sadness hours. We lost 72,000, but we've killed 34,000. Not good enough. Uh, there you go. Help out, help branch out. How much manpower? I'm sure they've got plenty of manpower, right? Oh, they got a lot of manpower. Stockpile. Oh, let's go look. They have quite a bit of equipment, but artillery is slowly going down, which is good. For killing all sorts of our divisions, these enemies shall perish. Oh, we've got plenty of guns. Artillery is still looking not too bad. The overworld will be ours, my friends. It will be. Actually, he's actually down here. Keep going, keep going. We gotta link up. Oh, the Great Fortress was encircled. We've got him. Improved infantry equipment too. Let's grab maybe some more of this stuff. No, it's a little bit. Oh my gosh, look, 1900 years ahead of time. Yeah, that's right. We can't research anything. <sighs> that sucks. But air doctrine. I think we're using. What are we using? Cass. We're using. Well, we're supposed to be using Cass. We have no planes around here. 
Um, well, all right, battlefield support then. We need to link up. They killed off so many of our own divisions, we must kill them all. Ah, mobile defense, good. Disperse support, let's go with integrated support. That'll be good. Link up. Oh, we've linked up. Somewhat. Good. That is a nothing but death. Oh, they got a port, that's not good. Come on. Come on. We've lost hundred almost two hundred thousand. They've lost wow, they've up to eleven divisions left. Okay, now let's let's just give it a little bit of a break here. You have three attack, you have seven attacks, so everyone's coming over here. Wow, we've lost a lot of guys, but that is a O K. There's a lot of enemies we need to take out, so. And we do have the undead lands to worry about as well. A bunch of fascists over there, too. Evil, evil, f wrong, incorrect, ugly fascists. I don't, know, I don't know if they're ugly or not. What's over there? Did we get a circle for realsies? Disgusting. Crafty eye. Kill them off. Good. Alright, we won the war. That was probably one of the fastest wars I've ever won in Minecraft. And again, I don't play a lot of Minecraft. Ooh, actually, do we want to do this? Well, you know, let's try to take all states maybe first. And if it goes poorly and we can't put it down resistance, then maybe we can uh, liberate them as puppets, maybe? Besides, we can use the resources anyway, so. All right, my friends. Civilian oversight's always very good. And zombie piglins. Wait, what are zombie piglins? No, 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 no. No wonder we weren't running everywhere. That's what we need. Very good. All right. Who is next? Wow. There's a lot of just stuff lying around. Can we Upper Plains Village, maybe? 50 days. That is no problem for this mod. The end of an era. The war is almost won. What our predecessors dreamed of happening has come true right before our eyes. With the bulk of the player armies defeated, we can now march onwards to claim the entire overworld. Oh, okay. Whoa. All right. Well, there goes that war justification. The Darklands. What are the Darklands about? They have no divisions. Actually, we, just, we can just go to war with them then, probably. I'm not too concerned about technology then if it's going to be this easy to take them out, so. Uh, wow. Well, it's only a little bit ahead of time. Diamond sword and kit? Now that's a diamond sword and kit, if I do say so myself. Oh, phase one. Get a war goal against... Oh! Crush a villager union? North villager union. Hey, there's a fallen kingdom over here, too. A bunch of fallen kingdoms with a Scandinavian flag. Weekly stability goes down. That sucks. Standing against a threat. Wow. I love war. Oh, wait. Who are they guaranteed by? Well, who are we fighting? Northwestern? Darklands? Oh. Uh, I'm not too concerned about them. So. Exterminate with extreme prejudice. Any good support? Let's grab some regimental combat teams. Very nice. We, actually go to, we can go to war with these guys too. Actually, at this point... You might as well just use one army to do this, so thank you very much. Alright, there's Sao Paulo and Choco Austral. Okay, then. Um, I'm just going to set up one army per group here, so let's see if they can, we can do anything. Fur tree, huh? The rogue portal's down there, if you see that. Look at that. Oh. Let our guys spread out and stop ruining supply near... Uh, just as much. Ken oh, we're going to Kenya. Did you know we're going to Kenya? I didn't know we were in Kenya. Oh, hold on. Spread out like a disease. Uh, let's go in, my friends. Bolivar. Mesopotamia. I love Mesopotamia. We are at war with a lot of people, aren't we? More artillery, though. Ah, I think we lost all that uh, equipment already or something. Beautiful. Are we out of... No, we've still have plenty enough for now, but... We will need some more in the future, so it's probably smart to increase this by a little bit more. 
Horse armor level. Jesus. Uh, you know, I want to make tanks anyway, so yeah, we'll try. Why not? Cool. More divisions. Throw them wherever you feel like. Flying formation. Very cool. Grab some dive bombing. Um, Has anyone done here yet killing anyone here? South Sakalin? The Western Dark Lands. This is almost too easy. I'm not sure where to build it, you know, an airbase, just because it seems like wherever I build it, um, we're just going to keep moving up anyways, exactly like this, so. Um, oh, okay, so this is going to, oh, hello, hello, another one. I don't know which ones we, we can go to war with or not, so, that's only 10 days, that's pretty easy. How long would it take for us to do this? Okay, 10 days. Okay, now it's British Columbia next to Jordan. I don't know if that's correct, but. Okay, so we got to wait for those two. That's fine. We are conquering them faster than I can actually set up lines for these guys. Oh man, I would hate to play as the Southern Player Empire because you don't have any time to really react to what's going on. And even though we're taking a lot of land, doesn't mean we have a lot of uh, things we can do about this. Uh, actually, these guys are not bad. Well, as much as I love the zombies, we're going to need some garrisons, you know. We don't have military police, god dang it. Um, nothing here increases suppression. Except horses. There you go. Just in case. Uh, compliance is still going up though. 0 0.3, 0 0.4. Very, very nice. Birtree Village. You ready? Yes, we are. And how long will that take? 10 days. 10 more days. Very good. And we have more fir trees. I'm sure they're probably closer to the east of side of things, so... Goodness gracious. Northern Canada, look at that. Um, guys, can you keep these keep going? I know I you, you're kind of done, but I'm kind of asking you keep going. There you go. All right, another fir tree done and taken. Well, northwestern darklands. Here we go. I really don't know which other fir trees we need to take out. But we're doing pretty darn well, I'd say, so far. Harakwepa? Very nice. At this point, just going just to find these guys too, I guess. I don't know. The faster we take them out, the less chance that they have to unite, maybe? I don't know. This is the fastest I've ever taken out a single nation. Like, this conglomeration of nations and such. Rio. Are we in, are we in South America? We gotta be in South America. Um, is this, are we just, who, who, they're all named the same thing, I don't know which one we're trying to fight. <sighs> Keep moving in guys, you're doing a great job. Do we have uh, expiration date on these ones? No, we kind of do, but not really. Oh, do you guys still fighting here? All right. I mean, this is eating into our supply of guns, but it's not too bad. Mendoza. Uh, which one's New Brunswick? Is this one New? Oh, this one is New Brunswick. Uh, let's finish one of these guys off first, maybe. You guys, up, okay, we got the other free village. I mean, these guys are literally just free villages. We're literally taking everything for free. Which, don't mind me. I love my diamond sword kit. That'd be really cool. More heart attack and piercing. Very nice. We don't want to produce garbage here, so thank you. Hopefully, we're taking some more resources, too. That's that's very, 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 very important. Guriev. 
Go to Yev. Have we finished this very large group up here? Tukuman. I said Tukan. Tukam. Very nice. Alright, South Angola? I love South Angola. Ah, finally, I know that Western Darklands are finished. Oh, that's 30 days. Wow, look at that. 30 days, actually. Oh, you guys can help out up here, too. All right, so that side is almost done. Um, all right. Did we win yet? <laughs> Are you winning, son? Um, I think we're winning a little bit too harshly down here. Oh no, can we swim? I think we can swim. Can Piglin swim? I think Piglins can swim. Supp uh, supply is looking really bad though, so. Oh. Are you guys moving in? Or, yeah, they are. That's good. Uh, how about you guys come up here then? Saskatchewan? I don't know if Saskatchewan was here in Minecraft, but okay. How many divisions do they have? None? Okay. So bad. We have to wait actually 30 days to justify now. I missed the 10 day justifications. It was such a good time. Another free village? I guess at this point we're just going to try to conquer literally everything here, so... Veracruz? Are you guys done up here too? No? Yes? Maybe? Arizona! I found Arizona! It's just somewhat close to Saskatchewan, that's all. Are you guys... Are, I can't tell who we're going to go to war with now. Oh, thank you. So you guys, ah, so we're done on the side up here. That's very, very good. Um, yeah, regiment of combat teams, mechanized offensives would be very nice. How many guns do we not have now? We have only three thousand guns. Holy, oh my goodness. Uh, oh, we gonna definitely need more supplies, aren't we? Close economy, it is then. More manpower. Dive bombing, sure. Uh, let's grab some direct ground support. All right, and then a um, little bit ahead of time for what we could really use. Uh, I'm not really sure what to do. I'd love military police, but we can't really get that right now. So let's grab support weapons for. Alright, yeah, we're gonna run out of infantry equipment here soon enough. This is not very good. You know, at this point, I think we have enough divisions. Because we're gonna run out of equipment here very, very soon, which is not very good for us. Hopefully, we're getting more resources to work with. Um, we're still going in, or what? What are you guys stopping for? Give no orders? Oh, that sucks. Can you go there? There you go. Alberta, I found Alberta. Is that 90 days? Holy, oh, uh, let's, let's wait then. Alright, so you guys. Alright, so we gotta figure out who we're actually attacking now. Is that the end of the focus tree? I think that's the end of the focus tree. Oh, phase two. Oh! Mr. Muckle Lover. Mr. Muckle Lover. What are you doing? He's being a dummy. That's what I'm doing. A real big dum dum. You know, I kind of wish our enemies were making more, like, equipment and stuff. So I could, like, when we take them over, we get more stuff. Because we're running out of stuff right now. Uh, we're about. Actually, 2600 oh, that's not too bad.
Alright, alright, not bad. Fiji found well, the Shang-Chi over there too. Wow. I should start puppeting some of these guys. Probably should start doing that, but oh well. Alberta. Oh, we still, we still have to justify you. Okay, that's okay. Um, I think at this point we have enough. Oh, there's, oh, there's an engine up there too. I'm gonna go start making some more military factories here, maybe. Um, yeah, that'd probably be a really good idea because we could probably use a few more military factories for now. Any other people have goals here? Maybe. Yes, no, maybe so. There you go. Keep going in, guys. You're doing a great job. Did you know it's year 11? I skipped year 10. What's year 11 now? Didn't even realize that. Abandoned base. That could be pretty good. Thank you. Cool. Keep going, keep going. We've almost reached the Greenlands. Hopefully there's resources here at the abandoned base. In Hainan? Oh, we actually took over some stuff. Look at that. Nice. Beautiful. Ominous Legion. That sounds... Ominous. How long would that take? 90 days. Let's wait for that one. Do they have any divisions? No. These undead guys do, which is not good for us, but... At least we keep getting more equipment, which is good. Good, 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 good. I love enslaving the peoples. Uh, the Marshall Islands, huh? Well, okay then. And then you guys go here. We actually did justify manually. Wow, look at that. Well, oh, support opens for nice. Let's grab Night Vision 1, perhaps. Oh, Somalia land. Somaliland. Very nice. Oh, we're going to war for Oregon. Nice. I think we've done a good job so far. But maybe that's just me. I mean, look at all that. Look at the island we conquered. This reminds me of the one egg thing I did. The, I played a mod like an Island Z or something, and we were playing it literally as on Egg Island or something. And it was a really weird other island too, but this reminds me of so much. Okay, we got plenty of guns. We just need more artillery. Hunan, cool. Ah, the Marshall Islands, my friends. I want to see what that other legion's like, but I don't kill off everyone else first. And wow, we're just. Om nom nomming them. Yummy. Is there a phase four? I could really use some more free just war justifications. Because we're getting super close to finishing this all all this up. Oh, are you guys Oh. Herm? Isn't that in Russia? And who can we go to war with? Ah, yes. Very good. Are we still have enough guns or infantry equipment? Yes, we do. Hunan, Ashgabat, Tobolsk, Kuril Islands, Novosibirsk. Either we're in Oregon or Russia at the same time. I can't tell. <gasps> more factories, though. Oh, we have no more steel, though. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. We're already on closed economy. Um. Hmm. Good. Are you guys? Are we just fine? Oh, direct transport would be nice. 
Even though we're not even using planes right now. Very odd, I know, but still. Uh, oh yeah, we're just talking about these guys. About a week left. Oh, I want the faster just fly world goal stems. Please, 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 please. Uh, but it's not too bad. 90 days is way too long to wait for anything. So, hmm. Good raise of conscription level. It's only more training time, which actually would not be a bad thing for us. Yeah, we're not even training any more divisions, so. Thank you. Not bad. Mechanized offensives. Shock and all. Yes, yes, we shall. And about two days left. And. Gabon, thank you. More military factories. I don't know what to do with the military factories. It's not like we can trade things away. Uh, maybe we have too many military factories right now. What the heck are these islands about? Uh, Albania. Oh, God, no. Not Albania. Anything but Albania. 90 days. My goodness. Wait, which nation are we justifying on? Is it these guys? Oh, it's these guys. Yeah, that's fine. It's fine. Crossbows? Yeah. Oh, wow, that's really, really, really ahead of time. Um, Night Vision 2, maybe? And then... There you go, we have no more steel. Where the heck are the resources on this map? There's some steel over here, but they're killing each other, which is totally fine with me, but still. Uh, you guys done yet? Let's go in. Sonora would be nice, too. Good. Get more fuel, which is nice. The undead lands looks like it's gonna might be a little bit difficult to take out. Um, yeah, not bad. They have no manpower, so it would be best to attack the undead lands first, probably. We're just finding anybody. No, no, we were not. But now we are. Are we supposed to take all these lands so that we would become very weak with trying to, like, pacify the area? But we're not doing too badly with that idea right now. I love Novosibirsk. And what other town that was? Alright then. Ashkabad. I'm gonna wait for that one. Um, that's not really worth it. We'll do it anyways because we can. In the meantime, I'm just going to make another line of gu uh, guns and stuff like this. Even though we can't even possibly make them. That's okay. And actually, instead, how about we do this instead? We're going to need this very soon, I bet, so. There you go. And who are we just find on? Was it? Oh, you guys are moving in, so that's good. Um... Two days left. There we go. Beautiful, my friends. Kransk. Kransk is game. Hey, Amur. Very cool. Eretria. I didn't know Amur was right next to Eretria. Wow. Who knew such a thing? I'm going to concentrate our guys right here in the center, too. Harat. Let's get these guys too. In about a week, which will be in about like probably three seconds, maybe max. I love it. Wow, but this is a, this is probably the most conquest I've ever done in a single episode of anything. The Ominous Legion. I think it's time we take them out. Okay. Oh, Nevada? I don't know that. Nevada's up here too. My vision's not bad. Um, hmm. Supply is probably going to be pretty darn bad up here. But, that's alright. Armored Horses level 2. We could use that, but... Eh. TNT. I love the TNT. Simon. Simnon. I almost saw that semen, but whatever. Thank you. Georgia? Is that like the city of Georgia, or like the country of Georgia? Alright, so we've got a few days left. They have no divisions. And they have about a couple thousand manpower and a lot of fuel. We get their factories. We can use them and abuse them. And all shall jump before the piglin might. 
All right, Georgia, you're moist. I love my Georgia's moist, which sounds very weird, but whatever. Let me go for Ce Ceylon. Um, the Sisterhood. No focus tree, but that's okay. And eventually, this they will get it. So, the Piglin Horde looking do be looking very nice right now, though. Harbath Sorsk. Come on, come on. Come on. Ah, we got him. Right? Is that it? Because we can start just fighting against these guys, too. That's 30 days. Oof. Give me one of you guys. The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants, which is a very old movie, I think. I don't remember. I never watched it. Ah, oh, the Ominous Legion. Very good. Centralized fire control. Let's grab some more Ford Observers. And we do have about 1,200 spaces for planes, so... Sign us up. Every army will get a thing of Piglin planes. We really need more cast. Holy crud. Should have went with tactical bombers, but I don't think we could have really researched them, so... It's all good. All right, I know it's very moist here, guys. Marshes are really bad. That's all right. Are we really poised to win a war here? No, but supply is really, really bad, so we got to do this. Wow. All right, so we got a lot of manpower. We kind of do not. Well, actually, we got way more manpower. Let's grab this. Three. That's nice. So we got Georgia. But it's very moist here. Nope. So now we finally have a contender. They've lost half a million. They've lost a third of a million. We lost 6,000. While killing off 40,000 of them. Not bad so far. Newfoundland? Oh my gosh. Why is Newfoundland all moist up there? Or up north there? Oh, what is going on over here? Why is resistance so bad? Oh, don't tell me this is their kingdom territory. Uh, Armored Horse level 3. That's one of the few things we can actually research. Anyone have upgrades, actually? No. That sucks. Slow. Oh, we took Newfoundland. Look at that. And they're just kind of playing around in the marshes. Playing around getting their little panties boy. Which, I'm sorry. This is very weird. Anyways. Uh, uh, this will be the last group we take out, obviously. But, uh, yeah. Actually, at this point, why don't we just do it like this? There we go. Supply is pretty not good. Which is a way for me to say it's not, it's bad. So. Uh, oh, very good. We got a lot of PP. A lot of political power. Uh, let's take a look. We lost about 30,000 versus 100,000. Not bad. Do they still have some manpower, or what's going on? They have 45 divisions. These guys have 46 divisions. They have no manpower. These guys no longer have manpower either. I'm going to say that our horde is just maybe slightly overpowered, maybe? Just slightly. Not too much, but just slightly. Just a little slight, slight. Oh, look at that. That is so sad. What are their divisions like? Actually, they're very well equipped. Look at that. They might not have equipment, but at least they, it looks good. Wow. Obviously, we're not winning every battle, and that's totally okay, but... Look, man. Man, oh, man. Keep going, keep going. We need Harat. Wait, why are you guys not... Ooh. Uh, you guys need orders, actually. Three v two. Let's see what happens. Uh... Improved infantry equipment three is very nice. Uh, crossbows? It's a little bit ahead of time. Uh, that's a little bit ahead of time as well. Uh, I'm not so sure about that one. I think we're out of. Uh, there's stuff. I think we're out of stuff. Trying to research. I guess we'll try to get some engineers. Why not? It's only one, two, three. Uh, about three to fifty thousand days out. So it's not too bad. Not great, but not too bad. We lost what fifty thousand, sixty thousand versus one hundred fifty-five thousand. That's not bad, man. That's not bad. Constantly having to readdress the line. Oh my goodness. Supply wise. Hey, we actually have a dockyard. Look at that. We can't build anything but ships, which is okay. 
Tiny little dinky boats. Beautiful. And the undead lands should be falling very soon. Seriously, just watching how much we can kill them off. 177,000. We only have 35% war score, and we have way more divisions than the enemies do, which is very, very nice. Look how fast the mod is moving. Oh, right. So, I don't want to be completely mean. I'll give them some territory, too. So, Fallen Kingdom, you can have some of this stuff. Vladivostok. Oklahoma. Did you know South Dakota is right next to East Bengal? I didn't. There, you can have Palestine. Okay, that's, is that a P word you can say? Ah, I said anyways. And I'm going to give them this one last thing, too. You can have Derna. You like some Derna? I would. Unfortunately, that's not the last state. We still have a empire to deal with here. A cancerous growth on our empire side. And just in case. Okay, oh, we're building dockers? Oh, actually, I manually built those. Man, this has gone by so fast. Go and do that there, and do that there, too. Supplies is not actually extremely bad. No, it's not extremely bad. Look at that. Construction repair. All right. Well, 30 days left, my friends. Until the destruction of the little fiefdom is over. Oh, the kingdom is over, really. Destruction is going to occur for quite a while. But that's all right. Yeah, give them 90 days. Why not? Well, we have got a lot of brave little soldiers. And Doglin has become an infantry expert. Level 5, 4, 5, 3, 4, 4. And a substance abuser, nonetheless. But that is okay. Queensland. Let us march in, my friends, and liberate the village from itself. I love the green. Forward observers, even though we have no recon, let's grab some advanced fire bases for even more stuff for recovery rate and organization for infantry. Oh, don't tell- Oh, is this glitch? No! I want to see how much damage we're doing. Man, that sucks. And we already know they have no manpower. Queensland, 27 divisions max. Oh, they had a little bit- Maybe they're- Oh, they must be mobilizing more. We didn't even have to mobilize. Well, we did mobilize once, but you know, whatever. All right. After that, let's get some crossbows. The northeastern village has fallen. Into the fray. The eastern village has fallen too. Ah, beautiful. Guerrero, huh? Can we get a war these guys too? Has it been ninety days? No, it hasn't. Okay. It's been close though. It's been very close. Ah, oh, the fallen village. You are. Well, you're about to fall. I w really wish that wasn't glitched. Okay, there we go. Take you up there. I guess we're going to Singapore, everyone. This is so sad. So incredibly sad. The kingdom is fallen, my friends. As it should. Well, I guess everyone, to the north, to Singapore. And we've got it. Is that it? Please tell me that's it. Uh, you guys can just kind of go around like that, maybe. A little crazy like. Um, it's still a glitch. Oh, Pennsylvania's down there. Okay. Pennsylvania's right next to Singapore? Of course it is. I need to know my geography a little bit better, but that should be it, my friends. Well, um, I guess that's going to be it. It's now April 4th. Uh, April, almost May, year 14. So we've been about this in mod for about five years. So this is our first look at the Hearts of Minecraft Overworld and Flames beta. If you enjoy the Piglin Horde and the extremely de destruction we set on the island here, Leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below. If we get this video, like I said earlier, to 250 likes, I'll probably go ahead and play Minecraft on the channel with some people. I, I don't know, but we'll play, maybe play some Minecraft. Regardless, thanks for watching, and have a great, great piglin rest of your day.